Hey guys, Blender Helix Alpha here. I'm helping you with another Blender tutorial. Okay, um, today we're going to learn how to make a basic structure of a human or humanoid structure. Um, we're going to make it look a little bit more realistic after we're done, and then we're going to make the basic skeleton of it and uh, see what we can do in pose mode. Okay, I have my basic cube here. I have zoomed out a little bit so you guys can see and stuff. Um, we, I'm going to go into edit mode, face select, select this first, this face right here. I'm going to press E Y one. I'm sorry, E Y two, and then I'm going to do it again. E Y two, E Y two. Uh, I'm going to do it one more time. E Y two. So now we have through uh, five. Um, blocks. I'm going to get this side on the last block, E, X, 2. E, X, 2. Okay, and then I'm going to do that, E, Y, negative 2. E, Y, negative 2. And just hit the minus key. E, Y, negative 2. E, Y, negative 2. So these are going to be the legs. Um, and then, and then E, Y, 2. E Y two, E Y two. I'm gonna hit this, this part right here. Um, e X two, E X two, E X two. Same thing here, only we're gonna go negative. E X negative two, E X negative two, E X negative two. Okay. Um. Okay, we're gonna hit this right here where the neck should be. We're still in uh, face select mode. We're gonna hit E Y two. E Y two. Okay, so now we have a basic stick figure like shape. I'm gonna go into object mode and show you how that is. Um Yeah. Basic basic and you can see that his where his thighs and hips are very strange looking. So what we're going to do, we're going to go into line select, hit this line right here. If you can't see, it's this line right here. We're going to drag this on the y-axis, this red line, and we're going to go up here. We're just going to shape his structure how it should look. We're going to hear his armpit, kind of. I'm going to go into a frontal view of him. Actually, I'm going to go into object mode. R, Y, 90 degrees, and then R, X, 90 degrees. So now I can have a frontal view of him. Okay. sure that all the lines are as straight as you can get them. Alright, it looks a little bit better. I'm going to work on it just a little bit more. Um, actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get this right here, drag it down, and then drag it in. This right here on the other side, drag it down, and then drag it in. Okay, now we have our basic guy. If you want to make it look just a little bit better so you can work with it, you can hit set smooth down here, right here. Um, but for now, I'm just going to do a solid. Uh, and I'm going to do a subsurf. We already have subsurf on it, but I'm going to make it level 2 instead of level 1, make it a little bit better. Okay. So now we have our basic humanoid structure. Um, this pivot point, it's now pivoting on this point that we created it on. And we don't want that. So we're going to go down here to the editing tab and then center new. So now it, it uh, rotates and everything on that point. Okay. So 
we're going to go to okay so now we're gonna we're gonna make the armature skeleton so we can pose them any way we want add armature you can learn a bit, little bit more about armatures on my last tutorial um, but for now I'm gonna assume that you've already seen it okay we're going to always start with the abdominal um, armature you're gonna select you're gonna put that armature right there in the middle select the very top connector extrude and then extrude this way same for the other side extrude this way and extrude this way hopefully by now you can see where we're, what we're trying to do here with this just do exactly <coughs> what I'm doing here okay uh, hold on uh, alright so we're, we're done I'm gonna go into object mode I'm gonna go here just to make it a little bit easier to work with we're gonna um, select stick okay which means it is now the stick now we can move this but our guy doesn't move along with us so what we're gonna we can move anything that we want but our guy isn't gonna move along with us so what we're gonna have to do is select our guy and then um, we need to make sure that our skeleton is perfectly aligned how we want it select three select our guy shift and select our skeleton control P armature no I'm sorry I forgot um, something to do with this real quick okay you wanna select I forgot to make the neck and the head we're gonna do that real quick okay select this first neck um, thing right here E Y oh sorry E X e, okay E Z um, scale about here and then E Z and then scale about here okay so now we're ready to parent them okay select that select the guy and then select your skeleton control P make parent to you're gonna get this and what you're gonna wanna do is click on armature create vertex groups question mark yes you do you want to collect you want to create from bo bone heat if this isn't happening just go back and do everything again um, you did something wrong but usually it should work pretty well okay create from bone heat so now that does it all for us and we're gonna be able to um, pose our guy uh, it's not working because we're not in pose mode so what you're gonna want to do is select your skeleton go into pose mode and you should be able to pose your guy and your guy would be able to follow with you and you can make him any pose you want um, just be sure you're in pose mode and hey how you doing um, and using our last tutorial the knowledge from our last tutorial we're gonna know how to animate so what we're gonna do is we're gonna select our skeleton go into pose mode get a timeline going here make your first keyframe go to 30 put this down here locate location rotation scale go to your next 30 and rotate it up here and then we're gonna make it normal uh, direction alright so this is just a small test animation to show you what it can do. <laughs> Very basic, kind of stupid, but there you go. That's how you model a guy and make him a skeleton so you can animate your guy. Um, thanks. This has been another tutorial with Blender Helix Alpha. Have a great day.